Alrighty guys, so we are back in the truck again. We are going back to the airport and yet we are going back to Baltimore. This time we are actually going to go to a Mecham car auction. If you don't know what a Mecham car auction, it's basically Barrett Jackson or any other car auction. It's just a big show. I mean, they have 1200 cars they've got going to this one. We're going to Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. So we have to get to the airport. We have to get on our flight and I'll see you guys in Harrisburg. How do you start your work day, Harrisburg? Alrighty guys, I'm filming on my phone. My voice is gone. My throat hurts. It's six o'clock in the morning. And we're at that quick trip, baby. Let's go. I got myself a water bottle. We're going to McDonald's right now. We got about three hours left, but we're, we're, we're staying in it. I've been in the car for 14 hours straight now and I am getting tired of it. But we will see you guys when we get home. Peace. McDonald's, how can I help you? Hi, can I have a bacon, egg, and cheese McGriddle and egg McMuffin? Twenty-four hours later, I slept for the past 23 hours. Part of the deal of me driving in this car all the way home, 14, 12 hours, whatever it was, part of the deal was I get to burn the tires all the way down till they pop, but yet we haven't actually revealed the car to you guys. So without further ado, our 1992 Fox Body Mustang, also known as the Musty Bird.
So while Dave fills up the rest of those tires, um, I'll tell you guys the story about those. Those are actually, they're 16 by 8, 1552s. I don't know what model they are. Those wheels, or these wheels used to actually be on a um, 1994 Mazda Miata, so like an NA Miata. And they, I'll, I'll dub a picture in because I think I still have a picture of it on my phone. But they actually used to be on an NA Miata and they made the Miata look like a monster truck. Hopefully the Fox body, it makes it a little bit more reasonable. The Amazon specials. What are, what's the warning say? Tighten no, it says, it, says right? thing, it says thanks for choosing us. How polite. How polite. They must be Midwesterners. <laughs> eh? Hey. <laughs> you said you said Mid Midwesterners, not Canada. So, <laughs> <laughs> is that what you said? People think you have a Canadian accent. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna get several comments. Oh, he's from Canada, eh? <laughs> you ride <laughs> ride a horse to work every day. A horsey. <laughs> a horsey. A horsey. I've seen you before. You were on a horsey. <laughs> look at him, dude. Oh, they're so nice. Would you just look at him? I think, I hope these work. It's gonna be so funny if they do. <laughs> I think it'll work. But I think these things are probably gonna be hanging outside of the fence. No, 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 no. So the funny part about it is actually the wheels that are on the car right now, if you don't recall, um, they're white wheels. And so the special part about that Mustang is in 1992, they had a mid-year refresh and they did a special edition, supposedly, as my dad says, um, called like the summer edition, right? The summer edition basically was like a white interior, it's a convertible, it's got the white top, it's manual, and it comes with these pearl white wheels. The wheels, now they look dirty in the videos because we drove it all the way home, but the wheels actually have like a pearly, kind of bluey purple pearlescent over the white, would you say that he would get pissed if we ruined them? Yeah. The white wheels? Oh, yeah. yeah. So my dad has some sort of weird connection to these white wheels, meaning that we had to change them immediately because he wouldn't let me do anything to the car unless I changed the wheels. As the car sits, you guys can kind of see, it's not in the sun, so you can't really see the pearl, and they're all dirty because they got brake dust, especially the front ones. The front ones are like black now, but uh, yeah, see, so you can like kind of see it in there. It's a little pearly on the corners and stuff when the sun hits it right. Yeah, so we're actually going to change those wheels and put those wheels on there. 1552, 16 by 8s. Um, I think they'll, they'll work good. The ones on it right now are 4 by 108 bolt pattern. And that's why we had to get spacers because those wheels that used to be on the Miata are 4 by 100. So then hopefully when we put the spacers on, they'll work pretty decent well you need to wear a helmet if you're gonna ride on the back of the car oh my goodness put it on dude come on dude that thing will never fit my head again it's an it. extra large that one might be a, i don't know that one might be large my other one the other one's probably oh yeah oh, this one's large. a large let's see if it fits <laughs> oh shit it does fit okay Dave, I don't have as many Dave, brains as Dave, I thought. Dave, you look like a different person now. <laughs> you, gotta, you gotta put the you gotta put the put the visor down though, because the sticker's there. You got the. <laughs> I can see really well a, now. It's like an eye patch. Dave. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 it's no safety. safety. First. That's, that's not that's that's safety second. We don't need that. It's oh, just, the helmet. We don't on. need that where we're going. <laughs> the helmets, the helmets on. The stick is getting into position. Oh my god. How you doing, Dave? I'm doing. I'm doing. I'm doing. Ready? I don't think this truck can roll coal. You don't think it can? I don't think it can. Look at the car is completely in the shade now. Now we can, now we can work on it. We forgot to tell him, Dave, about the built-in sword. Oh, oh my God! There, it loosened. Look, look at, look at it loosened it up right away. It's like, <laughs> whoa, whoa.
<laughs> the uh oh <laughs> you didn't even know this part first thing my dad says when we get to the car well the windshield wipers are a little messed up <laughs> so we, we're gonna we're gonna go through clearly it's a five liter which means there's five liters of water already in it um we have the pony creator the turbinator <laughs> the turbinator no, uh -huh. the, i think the turbinator is down there oh. see because that looks more like a turbinator that's gotta this be the cavooter no this is like the apple core or something like that i think they call that part <laughs> but, but, but. only only long tube headers david yeah yeah, yeah. Special edition, right? I mean, there's the only the greatest of the great come with the leather distributor cap, Dave. Maybe not enough. When we were doing it, it definitely does overheat a little bit. Um, as you guys probably saw, I hope that I put it in before these videos or before this clip. When we were doing the burnouts when we got home with this car, it did overheat quite a bit. I mean, it wasn't like blow the radiator cap off or anything, but it was. The gauge said 270, but I have a feeling it says that a lot. Right, yeah. I mean, 270 could be a anything you know that could be how much horsepower it was putting out at the time it could be how hot it was it also could be the outside temperature i mean it, it is wisconsin you know could be the weight limit weight limit too yeah i'm at my i know i look slim but by golly my <laughs> rear end is packing let's get into putting the wheels on and stuff we got four wheels like any normal car wheel spacers let's jack this baby up and let's get her going must be nice driving. Must river. must be nice driving a new car, Mike. Must be nice. I don't have any. Must like, be nice. Stuff though. Stuff for what? Is that your stash? Heck yeah, it's my dude. 3D energy drinks, man. Alpha Land. Because I'm an alpha predator. We got one minute with Mike. Here we go. Mike, tell uh, tell people what's up. So guys, up. Uh, we're out here uh, about to change some wheels. What, uh, where, what were you doing earlier? Uh, the sun is shining. What were you doing earlier? Like, tell the people what you're doing. I was golfing. We're out here golfing. That's amazing. Bad at golfing. So I was always the first to go to see what's up. <laughs> Feel off the hole. Mike puts his pinky in the in the pond first. Like when I be put when I be putting. I was always the first one to go. Is like watch what the ball does and then. Because <laughs> <laughs> scramble race, you play best ball. You know. Oh, nice, nice, nice. So it's like Mike is literally just a throwaway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, I had a few. We took a few of my shots. Like, like exactly two. Like nine holes. <coughs> oh, man. That's a great video right there. Well, you're just, it was just such a touching story. You're choking me up a little bit. <laughs> we just took a sip of our drink at the same time. It was pretty cute. Parking ticket? Michael, you got a parking ticket? Where? How much is the parking ticket for? Six. Six. Oh. Dude, that's a lot. I don't think you're ever going to financially recover. Hey, Dave. He's the second one I got in like six months. He's a felon. You are a don't felon. Tell people I'm a felon, John. I think out of the three people in this conversation right now, the one wearing a polo that just came from golf outing is probably the least relevant, like, least felonish. But I wouldn't say Dave is much of a felonish character either, so. Who here has been arrested? Yeah. <laughs> now what? They guy's talking over here like, I got arrested for a parking ticket once. Uh, I did. That right. was stupid. You ever heard that story about Dave getting arrested? Dave got arrested. Dave got re oh. legitimately arrested. Yeah, uh, doing something? Green Bay? No, a parking ticket in Green Bay. You got arrested for a parking ticket? I didn't pay my parking ticket. <clears throat> I filed to challenge it, and I never received paperwork in the mail. Nice. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, yeah. Dave, yeah, 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 yeah. Dave, oh, I, I... Yeah, they issued me a warrant for, what was it, Brown County and surrounding counties? <laughs> and, of course, my talon had a muffler on it, right? And it was like 1 a.m. on the highway, and the sheriff is in the median, like, not doing anything. He's looking for trouble, so he starts following me. I go into the quick trip, because I, I see him following me. So I go to quick trip, and I'm like... Yeah, I gotta, gotta grab money from the ATM anyways. Come out of the quick trip, he rolls up all stealthily behind me. He's like, hey, are you David? I'm like, whew. Yeah, why? He's like, you know you got a warrant? I'm like, no, 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 you have a warrant. I'm like, 
For what? Well, looks like you didn't pay a parking ticket in Green Bay. I'm like, shut up. <laughs> you guys don't do warrants for that. And he's like, yes, for Brown County and surrounding counties. That's wild. I literally had to go to jail, like book and release. Luckily, I had $20 in my pocket to pay the parking ticket. You, you feel like quite a hard ass now, Mike, don't you? Yeah. Mr. $6 parking ticket. Yeah, don't pay it. See what happens. <laughs> Ready? Uh, I am not ready. You ready? I am now ready. Three, two, one, go! 